Hello, you divine, infinite human beings, you're all that is, ever has been, and ever, ever, ever shall be. And I want to do just a short video this evening about something that's been coming up for me, and it's called Getting Your Wings, Your Plasma Wings. And yes, it is true. I know when I first heard about it, I thought, oh, come on, it's kind of hokey, you know, wings. Uh, you know, sounds like it's a wonderful life. Clarence trying to get his wings, if you've seen that good old oldie Christmas, you know, and every time, you know, teacher says every time a bell rings, some angel gets their wings. Well, there's something to that because first of all, as I write in my book, The Infinite Human, and if you don't know me, I'm Elizabeth Monroy, the author of The Infinite Human, which is an ascension guide for star seeds, twin souls, and awakening infinite humans, the co-creators of the new 5D Earth. And um, this is something new though, and one of my infinite human family members sent me a message saying that she had this incredible meditation at this spiritual retreat where she got her wings and she thought she was going crazy. but. You know, it's true, and I've seen it in a lot of the spiritual communities, people talking about it. And for me, just recently, I have been going through the very painful process, okay? So one of the things that I want people to be aware of is that ascension isn't always just, you know, la di da -di, you know, oh, it feels great, you know, I got my wings. But it is sometimes very painful because... Uh, part of the wings, of course, think about where wings are. Now, these are plasma wings that are part of your plasma body. So you might not actually walk around with wings in your physical body, but you do start to have a wingspan and you start to carry that weight of the wings in your physical body. And it feels like right uh, I, you know, your little uh, wing bones, you know, right? Where your uh, trapezoids are, you know, between your um, shoulder blades. And I've had, for me, and I'm, I've seen a lot of people who have complained about a lot of neck and back and shoulder pain um, because you're starting to uh, carry that, that magnificent, huge, angelic, divine wingspan. And I've had so many signs about this process that has been going on for several months, especially since I came to the Yucatan here. I've been seeing all kinds of angelic uh, creatures, you know, and, and angels everywhere and wings. And in fact, today I saw one, which is on the cover of this video, of wings. And I just knew I had to t make a video about this because it is something that happens. It's an initiation. It is a... Um, certain level of being a Christ, Christala being, a Christ being. Um, it is also aligned with the the bell ringing. The bell ringing, which, which I talk about in my book, is when you're activating your higher chakras. Um, you begin to have flying dreams more. You begin to be in your true form, which is traveling through, you know, with flying and moving through the higher dimensions. Um, you begin to wing it more in life, you know, uh, literally moving more with intuition. And I just want to show you this. I chose this spot there. You can see. <laughs> that is our true nature. We are, you know, angelic beings. And the angels that we have been taught to, you know, our angel guides or to pray to in the Bible have been fallen angelics. So we are the angels and we are reclaiming our crystal of Christ's bodies and our plasma wingspan. With, and with it comes many, many uh, wonderful abilities to wing it through the physical and to navigate the higher dimensions. So yes, if you're having these pains, your wings are sprouting and expanding. Ciao for now from the Yucatan, Mexico.